code is something else. The film Romeo and Juliet has a love scene between two 14-year-olds. But you have to be 21 to see it. Perhaps the reason more women don't run for the Senate is because every six years, their seat is up for grabs. <laughs> problem is that the people in the backward countries are way much too forward. Kids today really have it soft. When I went to school, it was 10 miles each way. And my chauffeur never complained. When I was a kid in school, I didn't do very well. It's not easy getting from the back of the bus to the front of the class in Mississippi. <laughs> I don't mind jazz influencing church music, but I still prefer amen to one more time. My parents are so old-fashioned, they still think I'm talking about television when I say tune in and turn on. <laughs> I guess those silly games are all right, but for good, clean fun, you can't beat camping. I took up a collection for a man in our office, but I didn't get enough to buy one. In, in Russia, we know got it, uh, problems with smudges with the automobiles. The biggest problem we have is with horses because of how horses have yakin yetics, unless it's cold outside. dinner, so I got a Japanese houseboy. Oh, he makes those marvelous dreams, darling. I think they should move Christmas to July. Then the stories aren't so crowded. The Russian people are very hospitable. They're always taking in borders. So far, they took in the Hungarian border, the Czechoslovakian border, and now they're making room for the Romanian border. I simply quit the Peace Corps flat when they assigned me to Ecuador. Nobody goes to Ecuador in October. Modern office methods have even affected the church. Nowadays, we have original sin and three carbon copies. <laughs> is operating at a loss. Mr. Golden says we either have to cut out our maternity benefits or do away with the cast parties. <laughs> My psychiatrist finally convinced me to stop looking at the dark side of things. Now they only convince the real estate people. I got stuck on a troop train from New York to California. You know, they're right, getting there is half the fun. <laughs> It's true that marriages are made in heaven. Unfortunately, divorces are available locally. I don't care about quickie divorces. What I need is a quickie anything. I never admitted this before, but on our honeymoon, my wife's mother slept in the same room with us. Did you ever try to save a good yell till you got outside? Madam Zodiac's sign for tonight is Libra. Yes, Libra is the sign for people born between September 23rd and October 22nd. Men born under this sign talk a lot and go around weighing things. They are called Librans. Women born under this sign are very quiet and go around reading books. They are called Librarians. <laughs> Look that up in your funk and wagnall. It is written, when the lips are dry and the body hungers, the soul is out to lunch. Funny, he doesn't look gruish. Tell it like it is, Sapphire. <laughs> Here is my review. 
Today, I attended the performance of one of the world's top-rated rivers, the Mississippi. My first impression was that the detractors who say that the river don't do nothing, don't say nothing, but just keeps rolling along, are making an unfair criticism. I say, what can you expect from a river? Why I Can't Stand Grief by Henry Gibson. I can't stand grief because it doesn't give us enough time to attend to our chores. Well, take, for example, the hurricane, which always seems to happen just as we're getting in the bathtub. In addition, there are the plagues. But most of all, it is those disasters which befall us willy-nilly, such as splinters. There are no good griefs. <laughs> Let's step right up and hear it for the salesman, the fellow who can sell you anything. Let's cheer it for the guy who sells your rug off the floor. Head in the cloud, foot in the door. His dad and brother Oh, well, he'll open for you, love you He'll even sell a haircut to a hippie A modern dancing course to Fred Astaire He'll try to sell some lessons Teaching stripes and to sing Ooh, The burdens to act uh, The non-bread at the wing He won't be selling this for more than ice box He'll sell a pound of peanuts to a zoo Crunch, crunch There's no resistance to his persistence For sales, when we wouldn't have all that stuff we don't need. <laughs> you know, people claim insurance men follow them over and over again, but I've only seen mine once, and when I die, I'll collect over $35 million. <laughs> I know one who talked a man out of jumping off a building, convinced the man to hanging himself instead. He was a rope salesman. Speaking of Colonel Cole, remember that's what the show needs is more nostalgia. I'll give you a little nostalgia. My husband's a salesman and he always guarantees prompt delivery. Nine months to the day, I was in the hospital. <laughs> And my uncle's a salesman. He sells seashells by the seashore, and he lisps. Oh, speaking of shells, oh, salesman ruined my life. Goldie and I were identical twins until he sold me that darn sun lamp. Health, the Avon lady married the traveling salesman, and they went away on a honeymoon. Maybe we'd have some peace for a change. Well, read my chimes. <laughs> Knock or a knock. Your telly a ting. Oh, heaven will protect the farmer's daughter. But who protects the farmer in the dell? He's bought and left me a fisher baby. Hey, Mr. Salesman, go to hell, my Turn right after this message. Since I started using your detergent, all my things come out brighter. <laughs> Children of America. 
Art Linklater is getting fat off your Weibo. You say quibble things, and he makes money off in it. And what do you get? Scale and no residuals. And what does Linklater have? A mansion in Beverly Hills, oil wells in Texas, sheep ranches in Australia. It's not fair. So, the next time Art Linklater asks you to go on TV, bite him on the ankle and say, kids do the darndest things, or something. I thank you. Learn to know yourself. I think all this psychiatry stuff is ridiculous. If parents treated their kids right, there'd be no need for psychiatrists. Well, my parents, for instance, always made me feel an important part of their life, even though they had very little education and only owned a small grocery store. They taught me to, to accept myself for what I am, a carrot. It's like I always say, the family that veins together stays together. <laughs> I'm your duty dog. Pull my string and I talk. Touch my little body and I hit you. I may be a dog, but I'm not dumb. <laughs> yes, you are. 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 You're dumb. Now go over there and stand by Goldie. Hi. That's a good little dolly. You know what? You're kind of cute. Touch my little body and I'll hit you. <laughs> with Avon calling and they made Katie Winters president, when somebody rang your chimes, you jolly well know you're in for a five-day pause that refreshes. <laughs> Spying hint number 281. <laughs> when, <laughs> when stealing state secrets from the Kremlin, always take the ones on the top. They're fresher. <laughs> and now a word from the Prime Minister of Indonesia. Careful, Walnetto. <laughs> And gentlemen, here's another draft card burner. What do you mean draft card? This is my diner's card. What's that got to do with Vietnam? How should I know? I never ate there. And now we go stumbling back through history to the studio of one of the greatest composers of all times. Take it away, Ludwig von Beethoven. Ludwig, what's the matter? Nothing is right. I feel tense, irritable. Do we have an aspirin? Now, what's the matter? Do you have a headache? What? I say, you have a headache! What difference does it make? Well, if you have a headache, you take aspirin. But if you want to write a song, you take Compose! <laughs> and now, for all you sports nuts, here's the cutest thing on spikes, that old wedgie himself, Alan Seuss! Ah, you sports fans! This is Big Al and the old football diamond with a sports editorial. Tonight, I have a word for the commissioner of baseball. Hi. Come on now, commissioner. Don't you really think those boots on the playing field look a little bit ridiculous? I mean those silly knickers. I say off with those silly knickers and let's get those boys into culottes. Well, that's it for tonight, sports. This is Big Al with a Big Al sports seat. Ta-ta. This was Stranger Than Truth. Granddaddy always told his youngins, it's better to beat our swords into plowshares. You hit a man with a plowshare, he's gonna know he's been hit. If they don't like a kid, why don't they go back where they come it from? This was Tell It Like It Is. Cannibals, they 
like people. This was Go Like This and Say Wrong. As Michelangelo said, as he finished painting the ceiling of the Sistine Chapel, and now they tell me they wanted wallpaper. This was Go To Your Room, Alan. This was, I don't know, I've never been out with one. I come from small mirror near Steve Uyetsis, but Uyetsis and Tortoye Vaichi. Roses are red and violets are blue. Sugar is sweet when it's brown. <laughs> this was, how does that grab you? I like to divorce my wife, but I don't have enough money. Borrow it from the bank, tell them it's a home improvement loan. This was blow in her ear. She'll follow you anywhere. I'd rather hear you sing than eat. Oh, oh really? Yeah, I've heard you eat. This was the big finish, folks. You will be right back, and you will like it.